Welcome to the January 9th, 2010 edition of Todd Graham's Daily Vlog. That's right, January 9th, 2010. You know what day it is, right? It's my fucking birthday. That's what day it is. And, then, and on my birthday, we celebrate lots of things. Let me tell you how my birthday went. Um, as I'm filming this clear after my birthday. Um, what did I do uh, on my birthday? Well, first, myself and a handful of my friends, that being Adam Nessel, Kerry Cummings, and Brandon Langley, along with my mother and father, went out to Bugaboo Creek Steakhouse. Now, I love steak, but I hate steak when it's cooked raw. I mean, rare, excuse me. And my dad loves raw steak. I mean, rare. So when dinner came, the, um, the waiter said, I got one steak that is rare, and I've got this steak that is well done. So naturally, I'm like, I will take the well done one. Thank you. And my dad takes the rare one, the ones we ordered. So it's about halfway through my dad putting all kinds of shit that I would never put into my body on top of his steak that we realize we've been given the wrong steaks. So here I am eating a bloody mess while my dad pissed off about his well done steak. Oh, the hilarity that ensued. Not only that, throughout dinner, see, at Bugaboo Creek, they have this thing where if you tell them it's your birthday, they'll come over and sing to you and make everyone else in the place sing to you and make you kiss a moose. I made sure to tell everyone at the table, if you fucking do it, you're dead. So I got through my entire birthday without anybody singing me happy birthday, and that makes me happy. Thank you. Um, as for everybody who said happy birthday to me, um, wow. I, wow, I, I've never had that many people uh, tell me happy birthday on my birthday in my life. I have about 400 friends on Facebook, a good handful that I don't really know, uh, and I think about half of them said happy birthday to me, which is fucking ridiculous because that's like 200 people. And I feel, and I appreciate it very much. I will not forget you because I do plan on thanking all of you one by one because... I'm unemployed. What the fuck else am I going to do? So wait for that. Also, not tonight or tomorrow night, which subsequently is tonight as well, by the way. Haha, <laughs> you know, I'm filming these uh, both on the same day. Um, I will put up a list of all the people that said happy birthday to me on my birthday a and the subsequent belated birthday uh, wishes as well, just because I'd like to see the list myself. So that's coming up. But, um,. So, yeah, and one thing to note about Bugaboo Creek is that we brought Adam Nessel. You know Adam Nessel. No, I don't have a stool punch clip. But you know Adam Nessel. He's the smallest one in the bunch. But he ordered the biggest meal. That's right. He ate the entire rack of ribs by himself and then built me a house out of the bones. I also bumped into a girl from my past on the way into Bugaboo Creek. And when I say a girl from my past, I mean, you know, from, from back there. But uh, if you want to hear more about that, maybe I'll do a vulgar vlog. No, I'm sorry, no. Um, but yes, I, find, I met up with an old friend at Bugaboo Creek. That was nice. And then, hang on a second. <clears throat> Could you get me some... Oh! And then, the very first Daily Vlog Classic, that's right, the annual bowling tournament, featured six players, myself, as the Fonz. And we had Adam Nessel, Brandon Langley, and of course, Ace Trav Yakovic. And also, two people that I didn't know were going to play along with us, Anderson Marr and Renee Solano. And you'll be able to see all the action well, that was filmed anyway, from the Daily Vlog Classic on the Daily Vlog. Just not on this one, on the next one. Um, but yeah, the very end, and I'm, I've already spoiled the ending on my status, but in case you haven't seen my status, I'm not going to spoil the ending for you. It was a very lackluster game the entire time until the final round, and that's when shit got interesting. Um, and then we came back to my house and had one of the more awkward house parties I've ever had in my life because it wasn't really a party. It was three different groups of people that are friends of mine in the room with me and 
we, we just didn't interact all together, <laughs> you know? So it's like I had some friends from high school, I had the friends that I hang out with now, and I had uh, two girls that whispered to each other the whole night. Yeah. Yeah, it was great. But no, I had a really great birthday, and I want to thank everybody who came out and everybody who gave me um, happy birthday wishes and all that. And um, I make, uh, like I said, I make this promise to everybody that I'm going to thank everybody one by one. If I haven't already thanked you, I will. And um, and I'm going to list your names on the vlog. Um, you know, I've been doing this vlog all this time, and I haven't come out to mention www.pzwrestling.tk, the one and only place on the internet to get all of your Project Zero Wrestling needs. That's right, and we all need Project Zero Wrestling. Oh, and by the way... <coughs> Hot Mops. I already got chastised for it by a couple of people. Remember a couple, uh, maybe about... Was it like a, almost a month ago? I was talking about the blizzard of PZW and how NECW had to cancel a wrestling show, and good luck trying to find a replacement show so you can film your television taping, etc., etc., etc. Well, because of that storm and that canceled show, they had to push their debut on television back to February. So, ha! But that, that's all I'm really going to say about it um, from now on. Uh, I, I'm not a huge fan of NECW, but what can I say? I like wrestling, and I like the and I like when anybody puts on a show anywhere. So good luck, fellas, in the future. I can't wait to see the show. Um, but with all that being said, um, I had a great I had a great birthday um, and all that shit. So there's really not much more to say except for oh, don't forget to tune in to Simon Eddie Television, where I show uh, the very first backyard classic uh, of 2010, featuring myself and my arch rival Tommy. Hellraiser Corbin. This match was filmed on my birthday. So tune into that, and um, to all those people who have birthdays coming up, happy birthday.